Friday night football beckons once again in the AIA Singapore Premier League tonight. We have Albrecht's Nagata against Tampines Rovers uh, right here at Jurong East Stadium. A game which has huge implications for both sides. Albrecht's Nagata are three points behind Lion City Sailors. That title race uh, just goes back and forth, doesn't it? They led the table very briefly, Albrecht's. Uh, Lion City Sailors are back in front. They've also had a very good win in the goal difference department recently. And for uh, Tampanese Rovers, it's an opportunity to leapfrog Tanjong Paga. That would be a remarkable achievement and also have a game in hand. Flicks across the goal. Here's Sugita, one of the standout performers. Lovely work here. Idetsu passes back to him, who cuts it from the byline. They're not able to clear their lines at the moment. Well, that's a very, very well-worked goal. It's a nice finish. Sixes and sevens, and look who it is once again. Kodai Tanaka gives Albrecht Nagata the early lead. But that defending from Tantanese. All over the place. On you, and now to Chris Van Huysen. They are a team that are quite happy to be patient, aren't they? Side for Dals. Into Kapitovic, and this is what he does so well. Spins off his man. That is an excellent goal for a number nine. That is classic Boris Kapitovic, and it's one all. Yeah, that's uh, such a well worked goal. Beautiful football from Tampanese Rovers. You have a look at this spell of possession. And all the way, played it out from the back. You mentioned patience. Amiral was in a good position. I think he wanted the ball from Kapitovic earlier. Here's Nakamura. Nakamura's going for it. Nakamura! <laughs> Tampanese Rovers with a long range effort. Bumper crowd in here to see it today. And he lets fly. Uh, not too much in the way of entertainment. But the second half started to open up. They could have come away with the win, they didn't. And then this one here, Albrecht's Negata, just struggling to deal with uh, Tampanese quality in possession. Ball is put in, it's a header in! Squeezed in by that man, who is fantastic in the air. And it's all business, isn't it? Get the ball, let's get back to the halfway line. There's barely any celebration. Uh, this is, again, I mean, Looks far too easy. Defensively, Tampanese Rovers once more, just getting the basics all wrong. There's a lot of ball watching. Now, can they profit from this just before half time? Hidetsu. Oh, just about got something on there. Shazwan, Sugita. He's been a bit quiet today. Sugita, Omori. Attacking that! Look who it is! That young man again, Ilhan Fundy, that's the kind of header you wanted earlier. This time he makes no mistake. That's, a, that's an incredible header from Ilhan. Again, the timing of the lead, wonderful delivery from Omori. Look at that, Sugita. Now Ilhan. Ilhan! Bided his time and then unleashed the shot. Two for him, four for Albrecht Nagata. I mean, this boy is special. He just peels away from Yamashita, and there's uh, far too much time and space for him to unleash a shot. I think it might have taken a little bit of a deflection, perhaps, off uh, Yamashita, but that quality eventually coming through. And perhaps the tempo, the intensity of Tampanese's play just uh, fell off slightly, and Albrecht were able to then take advantage of that. And also the fact that, I mean, Tampanese Rovers defensively again, once more, just far too open in terms of conceding chances and conceding goals. But otherwise, it's been a very entertaining encounter between these two sides. Lovely game of football, and uh, you can see just how hard Elbrex Negata have had to work to pick up the three points uh, in this one. Players slumped over, uh, but job done in the end.